free or paid? Which DaVinci Resolve version should you get? The free version or the paid version? In this video, I'm gonna go over the differences between the free version and the paid version so you can figure out which version has what you need. So let's get into it. First, if you're new here, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification to be updated on the newest videos put out. So first up, we're gonna go over the stuff that the free version has. One, it's free, like straight out free. In fact, they pay you. All right, all right, that's a lie. They don't pay you, but it is free. It also supports 4K UHD, so that's fantastic also. But if you wanna obviously work with like 6K or 8K, you just have to get the studio version. Like, that's just what it is. There's no watermark on the free version. Like, it's just straight up free. Your footage will not have a watermark in the bottom right, top right, top left, bottom left. Nowhere, it's in the center. I'm just kidding, there's no watermark. Literally in its free version, this program is amazing. And it has most, if not all of the other things that you need to do not only YouTube videos, but like professional grade work. My buddy Jay Lipman makes YouTube videos and does all of his client work. He's a video editor. He does all of his client work on the free version. And he's done that for like almost a year. So you can, with the free version, do most, if not all of the things you need to do. Moving on to the paid version of DaVinci Resolve, it retails at $2.99. And first of all, it gives you all future updates. You don't have to buy any more future updates. You don't have to pay a monthly fee. It's literally $2.99 and it's yours. There's GPU support. So if you have like a baller GPU, then this is gonna most definitely help you. GPU support is not on the free version of DaVinci Resolve, so that, that kind of sucks. Like, I have an overpowered graphics card, and if I couldn't use it, I'd be really sad. You also get the denoiser, which ultimately removes unwanted noise from footage. There's 3D tools in the Fusion tab, in the free version, there is none. You're not able to use it. There's more, I mean a ton, a ton more. Resolve FX. There's motion blur effects. You can have a collaborative workflow so there can be multiple people like sharing around the projects. There's HDR color grading. And to top all that off, there is amazing customer support from Blackmagic Design, which you only get access to if you have the studio version. Ultimately, there's a lot of great stuff on that paid version list, but if you don't need the denoiser, the 3D tools, the Resolve FX, the HDR, color grading, the motion blur effects, then really save yourself some money. Like stick with the free version, invest in new camera gear, invest in new lights, like up your production value if you don't need all of those, you know, effects. Now, of course, you won't be able to take advantage of the GPU, which is really important for me. But if you don't need it, like seriously, save yourself some money, invest it somewhere else, invest in your business, invest in your brand, do your thing. Trust me, if you don't need it, save your money. I personally have the studio version and I love it. But like I mentioned earlier, my friend Jay Lipman doesn't use it at all. So that it's really like, what do you actually need? and which version works for you. If you can get away with the free version, stick with the free version. But for me, I needed the stuff in the paid version. So the question of the day is, which version of DaVinci Resolve do you have? And if you have the free version, do you think you're gonna upgrade in the future or is it good for you? Let me know in the comments below. As usual, the video on the top is all about the best mic for $20 you can get as a beginner on YouTube. And the video on the bottom is a video that YouTube thinks that you would like. But until the next one, peace.